Okay, so this is my Rick Max Coyote. It's the electric power version, but I don't need the electric today. I think I might need a bit of nose weight in this. And the other problem is, is the wind is coming where I'm facing at the moment. So we've got the hill, the other side of this little valley causes problems. So I'm gonna try and get this in safely. Right. Okay. Well, I've only put five grams up front. If I need some more, I'll put some more in. See, just that little bit of weight's made the difference. It's a little bit nicer to control. So this has ailerons and elevator. So this one I've had ready for a while actually. But it's, I only want to fly it when the winds are light. So we've had quite a lot of strong winds when I've been here. So it's not really been suitable. I never like flying when the wind is in this direction where it's more sort of northeast. Oh, got a nice bit of lift there. Because uh, it's always very, always very bumpy because of... Uh, if you look where I'm facing now, the wind is coming all over from that landmass over there. And it gets very bumpy. But suddenly we're getting a good bit of lift here. Yeah, it's a good little glider. I'm in two minds whether to make it a pure glider or not. That's okay, it's got into lift again. So I can feel the wind has dropped off. Now it's picked up again. Am I able to get back in the lift? Whoa. <laughs> I'm trying. There it goes. Right, just touch it down. Yeah, so the wind is really on and off here. And it's not really helped by that hill opposite. It's better if it's just slightly off from north. Um, sort of north, northwest, that direction. 